What up, y'all? It's your boy, Dewan Collects here. And I have something very exciting, as you can see. Matching tee brought to you by Cavity Colors. Yes, I always rock that fresh Godzilla gear. Go to their site and get some for yourself, too. Um, so, back to the schedule program. You can see right here, what does it say? Battle Roar Mecha Godzilla. Yeah, so... I'm not sure if Target's getting these, but uh, I know Walmart is, but my Walmarts suck in my region, and I don't feel like waiting forever to get this. So I, you know, hit someone up on eBay, struck a pretty good deal. Uh, it, it would be $15 in store. I only paid $20, $20 with free shipping, so only five more dollars, $21.64, $65 with tax, which is normal. So I figured, no, nah, not bad. Five more dollars. Who knows if I'm ever going to see it get here. I want to get y'all some real cool new uh, content. Uh, I want to hand snip the zip ties for y'all. So as you can see, this is the new MonsterVerse uh, packaging. And let's see what it says uh, on the back. The monsters of ancient myths and legends are real and battle for dominance across the world. Sorry if I've read this before. I can't remember. Uh, humanity's efforts to coexist with these titanic forces of nature is led by Monarch, a highly equipped organization of the bravest scientists, adventurers, and military specialists in the world. Now humanity enters a brave new era of discovery filled with unknown dangers. Monster Battle Sounds. Uh, why is that? Uh, okay, I, I'll just read this. I felt like I, it looks very familiar. Godzilla vs. Kong. Legends collide as Godzilla and Kong, the two most powerful forces of nature, clash in a spectacular battle for the ages. The cybernetic terror, Mecha Godzilla, rises with unstoppable powers of destruction and armed to the teeth with a devastating arsenal of weapons to face Godzilla and End the reign of monsters once and for all. <laughs> so he thought. Um, so there you see. Uh, Battle War. Godzilla. And then here's Mecha. And as you can see. Cool picture from the movie. Um, get him out. Tail. Attached. Let y'all take a look at this. If you haven't viewed the previous videos. Thanks for being here. Uh, you see uh, Warback, Ghidorah, Godzilla, Mecha, and Kong. Uh, go ahead and set this over here. So, like usual, easy socket um, attachment for the tail. And... Oh, uh, I hit the button. We weren't supposed to do that yet. <laughs> Man, this tail really don't want to go on. So, you really got to, like twist and you know squeeze pushing on there so i went ahead and uh dug out the regular mecha godzilla just to see the scale and size um i'm not sure if this is like a six inch figure and he's more like seven inches he's slightly taller uh his red on his uh, dorsals is more vibrant on the roaring one versus these are a little more dull um, this is like a hard, he's got vinyl, like bendy parts. And then there's like hard plastic. This one's definitely solid plastic. I'm going probably wear the battery. Yeah. Battery compartment in the chest. Uh, he's not, well, yeah, he is the same amount of articulation. Well, not his, uh, elbow joint. Well, neither of this one. So it's, uh, rotates at the shoulder a uh, cool thing about the shoulder pad, um, as we'll say, it's uh, real flexible, real soft and bendy. Uh, I feel like they should have done with the claws. They should have been able to open and grasp and rotate. For some reason, they didn't. You can see on this one, he's got like a, cl a closed grasp. And on this one, they're both open. Uh, the legs... Um, the feet are a little bit different, uh, slightly, with the positioning of the toes. Uh, more bendy, soft attachments uh, to his armor, especially on his hips. 
Uh, both of the dorsals on these are real uh, flexible along with the tail on both of them. So it's pretty similar. Um, I didn't dig out Godzilla and Kong. I'm trying to see if I see them around. But if you, you've probably seen them already or go ahead and look at the channel, view the video. Uh, they made them look Kong significantly different. Godzilla a little different. has a different pose. I feel like they should have done more with Mecha and not make him look so similar. I mean, I guess like he's a... Uh, I guess he's more detailed. Yeah, I guess they did that. Um, his uh, armor, like, detail, it's more um, bold. It's uh, it's more precise, you know, with all the details on it. So, I've talked enough about it. I'll do a side-by-side -side comparison so you can see just right there already on his, uh, his um, bicep and his forearm how... You can see the X's and all the imprints a lot more, and this one's not. You can see they're both like essentially the same gray. This one's a little uh, darker. This one's a little more silvery, but uh, it just he looks more prominent. So they put more into this figure, I think, than they did with this. And um, just when y'all get a look, I'll go ahead and set him to the side. So. One thing they have yet to do on any of these uh, Playmates figures is we've seen that cool death spinning tail drill in the movie and none of them have that feature where it could at least articulate, rotate. But, uh, you know, his tail will twist. It's real bendy. I like what they did with the figure. Um, his legs got... A little bit of motion to him is more stiff on this right side for it. Okay, there you go. He just gotta warm his joints up, I guess. Now he's uh, essentially he's gonna be flying old school. Um, so yeah, the regular decent articulation. Uh, I'm sure y'all ready to hear more of that roaring action. So right here on the side, right here is his button. This side is more flat. This one sticks out and pretty dope that echo reverb effect. Uh, I've tested it out. I think he has three roars, but let's go ahead and hear it. Yeah. That one you can definitely hear Ghidorah's uh, BDB, you know, his... Uh, chirping shrilling you know roar that one sounds like godzilla and then this one is uh the robotic so sick and epic i love it so there's three very cool figure i love it um if you didn't know by now or i'll remind you i'm definitely a big cat kid at heart Obviously, you look around. <laughs> but um, not everyone's into gimmicks of roaring and light up. That's definitely my forte. Uh, you definitely got to feature that in toys. This is a kid's toy, four and up. Uh, but it's still a cool little piece, you know, collect from the movie or just add to your collection overall. Um, you know, it, it would be cool if... Uh, they made him more metallic looking like the Monsters, which I finally got. And guess what? That giveaway of a thousand subscribers, free Monsters Mega Godzilla, is coming this way finally. Cause uh, I got, I paid for the one that's uh, Awesome Collector, and that one was for me. And then Sideshow ended up getting it back in stock because it was like, like almost sold out right after that. I had to be on a wait list. And then that's when I came up the idea. I usually do a Sideshow because they have the reward system. And I was thinking, how could I entice maybe more people to help this channel grow? And so I thought, hey, I'll just cop a second Mega Godzilla $150 value free for one of y'all lucky, loyal subscribers, man. I, I appreciate y'all. We're still a long ways away, but it will stay still sealed in box. And I will show y'all maybe next video I'll do it, or I'll just wait till I get the second one hands. Approve y'all. Boom. Here's what one of y'all can have. And then we'll see me tinker around with 
mine. I end up buying the sideshow on with tax money a couple weeks ago. And so that one was going to initially be y'all's, but it doesn't really matter. Tomato, tomato. Uh, sideshow got theirs first and then awesome collector took very long for whatever reason. Um, but it's finally on its way. And so, yeah, go ahead, share, make sure you're subscribing, comment, like, atomic blast that like button, you know, all the goodies. Um, I'm going to do my best to keep from coming. Oh, that's a very cool feature about his, um, his ankles, his feet twisting. This one does it too, but it's got... It's just, I don't know, it, it it feels and looks better with this one. And uh, I guess I could show you all with the toes. You can see how it's more on the back on the side. And on this one, it's it's still on the side, but it looks more prominent uh, sticking out in the front than this one. You can just see the placement of how it's done. But it's like a revamped version of this. And definitely with the... coming right at you that might be my fi I don't know man I love oh, man I like them all but it's like that second one is like my favorite it's so sick but it's like when you get to hear Ghidorah in it like bravo playmates like y'all really did y'all's thing with this one um it's got the best roar out of the three um well I guess I have Kong right here. Where's Godzilla? I didn't realize I had Kong right there. Um, hmm. I feel like I should be having them together. Um, showing y'all. Is that him? No. Uh, too sure where it's at so screw it i'm just gonna leave kong there he's not getting extra treatment it's just gonna be all mecha solo in this so yeah i definitely highly recommend this if you have it at your walmart or if you want to pay a few extra bucks there's a lot of people that have raked them up higher but uh, i always look for best offer on ebay and a lot of these people are pretty reasonable this guy had it listed at 30 bucks and i offered 20 and he accepted it right away um so yeah, if you can't find it in your store like me, then go ahead and go online. I'm not sure if Target's going to get it, um, but, you know, keep looking. But I'm uh, pretty sure I'm all up to date with all the Playmates releases until maybe that uh, cool Ghidorah we saw a while back on the toy reveal uh, comes out. But I haven't seen it anywhere online. Uh, hopefully it comes to shelf. And, uh... Yeah, I guess that's going to be it. Let's get a couple more roars, and then we're going to be out of here. Try to keep it short. And. Uh, man, I've been wanting to watch this movie, man. I think I'm going to end up having to do it. I love the battle scene. My favorite part is when... Um, you probably see it gifing around online, but when Mecha Godzilla turns at the camera, it goes, nur, 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 you know, makes the cool robotic noises as his eyes glare at the screen. Um, but yeah, man, I love this thing. Y'all tell me what y'all think. Uh, I'll be back with some more. Hope y'all doing well. Take it easy.